What's going on, everybody? Today is October the 8th, 2022, and that marks the 30th anniversary of Mortal Kombat hitting the arcades. Now, I know I'm here next to Mortal Kombat 2, which actually wouldn't release until the following year, 1993, but I want to talk about my love for this franchise and for this game. It helped define the fighting game genre as we knew it. I remember being a kid, going into the arcade, dropping some tokens or some quarters wherever I was at. Preferably at a place called Aladdin's Castle, um, back where I used to live. There, playing Mortal Kombat and also Mortal Kombat 2 even. I remember, you know, um, people making friends and enjoying these games. I remember uh, seeing people come up with ripped pages from a notebook and they would put them up here and to, to do all the fatalities and the combos and things like that and uh, this is just an amazing history of this franchise that really once again helped define the fighting game genre and um, I've had the pleasure of getting to know and be friends with people such as Daniel Piscina who worked on the games he was Johnny Cage, Scorpion, Sub-Zero, Sub just to name a few of the characters that he played and um, such an amazing person for being able to do just that. Definitely, um, Mortal Kombat has always been a big part of my childhood and uh, something that I'll never forget experiencing when I walked into a darkly lit arcade, much like the one here at Rec Bar. And I want to thank Rec Bar for allowing me to come here and film and be able to make this video. And I do appreciate them. If you're ever in New Albany, definitely come out to Rec Bar, Rec Bar 812. And they have a ton of arcade games to play here, pinball machines. There's a lot of great food choices. There's a downstairs bar on their second floor, which is where I'm at right now. They have an, uh, On their main floor, they have a big, huge bar up there as well. Lots of great games to play and experience. You can get tokens. I love, I love tokens. I just I always, always loved tokens, uh, collecting tokens as a kid. And they have so much more that you can come here and check out in the heart of New Albany, Indiana, and Southern Indiana. So if you ever stop by here, definitely come by to Rec Bar. I highly recommend this place. It's my local hangout spot that I love to come and enjoy some pinball and, and so much more. As you can kind of see behind me, there's, there's a lot of pinball machines. I don't know, maybe you can see it, but pinball machines behind me. But as I'm talking here, you guys are going to see all that already as uh, I show you guys this entire place. It's huge. They have like Toys R Us signs, a Blockbuster video sign, which is very special to me um, because I worked there. I also worked at Toys R Us as well, but a, an amazing place that I highly, highly, highly recommend you come and check out. But um, it's, I just can't believe that it was 30 years ago today, October 8th, that this game came out. I was eight years old when the first Mortal Kombat dropped, and it's just defined the genre. And... Uh, I don't know if you guys remember when it came out uh, on consoles as well, which next year will be the 30th anniversary of the game hitting consoles. Crazy, right? The Genesis version will always be superior, by the way, because, well, it, it had blood and the Super Nintendo version didn't for whatever reason. Probably because it's Nintendo and they're all family friendly. Anyway, um, let me know in the comment section below some of your favorite Mortal Kombat memories, your, your, your arcade experiences, whether you were a kid or a teenager, what have you, an adult. Let me know those in the comment section below. We do check out our comments and we respond to comments, so please do so. Most of all, please be sure to subscribe to our channel right here on the domain for all kinds of video game reviews, uh, videos, unboxings, and so much more. We also do thrifting from time to time. We go to conventions and check them out and walk you through those so you can check those out with us. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you.